the place. And then that was the last time that, uh, that the class ended at, at that particular point. So Imam Muhammad, he actually taught his class here. His, his, uh, his uh, uh, lectionary would be right back, uh, back there. Now, I can picture myself sitting right around in that area and listen to the Imam. So the Imam's spirit is here. Uh, the Imam, uh, so it, it's a blessing. This is the, the, uh, the mosque here. The mosque here is owned in this building. Imam Muhammad left to the mosque here. Uh, the president of uh, W.D. Muhammad II. Uh, he's in charge of it. And, and the goal is to expand it. And to expand it, it will cost some money. Uh, you know, instead of us going to the hotel, you know, we could expand out and maybe back. But we can have our first Sundays right here. And then, uh, you know, that's, that's something. that uh, you, you can actually see it grow. Um, and it's a blessing. And uh, a lot of things that's going to come out of here. Now, the brother, he mentioned about uh, your product. Uh, your product, uh, I just saw on the, uh, on the uh, uh, Constant Contact, they got the uh, cutlery uh, thing as a, as a new product. And it's steadily going to grow, bit by bit. You know, we got people uh, around the country who uh, <coughs> have uh, made things that are uh, very uh, quality and so forth like that. That's an opportunity uh, for them to market that stuff through your product and, and so forth. So we started out with coral cal calcium, uh, with, uh, from coral calcium to uh, also the, uh, the, uh, the cutlery. And now you look at the, the, the on the internet, you look at the pictures of the cutlery. cutlery. Man, it looks real nice. Very inexpensive. So um, that's an opportunity to uh, to uh, invest in it, opportunity to, to uh, develop it, and so forth. And uh, 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 W.D. Muhammad II, uh, uh, he's looking for input for anybody who wants to uh, be involved in it. All right, I think we got it uh, set up right now. Uh, I think I had to say it in that sheet. No, that's, a, that's okay. okay. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to, as long as I can see it a little bit. Definition. That de uh, that definition would grow, and you make connection after connection after connection. I mean, you get it uh, from anybody else. I mean, uh, the the other te the teachers, they ha they have been in charge of uh, the image of, uh, of Al Islam, the Hafiz, the old guard, the old Hafiz, the old protectors of the the image of Al Islam. You know, from out of uh, Pakistan or Saudi Arabia and <coughs> Libya, or whatever. It, they all have that, uh, that charge. But we see now that uh, they have failed their charge. <laughs> because the image of Al Islam in their hands has sunk to the, to the pit. And it was the grace of God because of the Imam <coughs> Muhammad. When he came in 1975, he gave the clear and the pure image of Al Islam and kept it out of the forefront. And now these people now, they have to, they have to step within the image that the Imam has put out there. Because the image that they have been hanging on to has, has been messed up a lot of ways. Oh, no. So, uh, again, the definition that the Imam gives us. The, uh, there's people that, uh, that wants to uh, uh, do their own uh, dictionary of uh, 
of, of terms that's within uh, the Quran. But Imam Muhammad taught for 33 years, and uh, he has given us definitions of many, many words that we should use. So the first one we'll start out with. You know this one, right? Oh, I can make it bigger now. So, uh, one uh, translator says, uh, in. But Imam Muhammad said, don't uh, use uh, in. In is, 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 is a good definition, but we shouldn't use it. Because the, ha the habit of, uh, uh, especially with Bismillah, is that uh, uh, the Muslims were in competition with the Christians. So, when they had, uh, in the name of Jesus, well, when you say in the name of Allah, you're using that in almost that same situation. A better understanding uh, is it, uh, some type of way we can make the uh, font more heavier? I know it is, but uh, we don't have to work, work um, on it now. Yeah. <laughs> we don't have to work on it now. You want to do it now? No, sir. Okay. Uh, can you see? If you, if you can see. Yeah, if you can see. Uh, we'll so work on it. If you go to, if you go to, if you can do it, because you can bold it. If you go to A, A that helps. Then I try to write. Try to write. No, that's just right. All right. All right. No, that's the, that's the, but I had to play with it a little bit to show you how to do it. Okay. There's a way that you can make it heavier so they can see it. Okay. 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 Um, but B. So uh, B, uh, uh, one translation is then. Then Imam says, uh, use with the name of Allah. Okay, with the name of Allah. So we use uh, with the name of Allah. But there's another commentary that the Imam says, use by. B, by. And the reason he says by, he says, he used the uh, technician uh, uh, technique that says, if you uh, uh, you were in a car and you got to your destination, how did you get there? By car. So by uh, by the name of Allah. Then the name of Allah. Uh, this one. You got this one. So we say by or with. Next you have this one. That means name. And uh, it says that Allah taught Adam the nature of things, the name of things, the nature of things. And then uh, there's a, a, a verse, uh, a chapter 59, 22, 23, and 24. We see uh, this one means the name, with the name, the plural of, uh, of that. That's that one. That's that one. Esma'un. <coughs> I don't know what I, I try to have, have to get rid of that little slash there. But Esma'un. That's plural. Names. And then in the, the uh, uh, chapter 2, uh, uh, 30, it says that Allah taught Adam the names of things, the nature of things. Well, then it says, Bismillah here. Okay. Uh, Bismillah, with the name of Allah. With the name. With the nature of Allah. And if you go to, uh, uh, again, I think it was 59, 23, 20. Uh, 24, 22, 23, 24, it says that uh, 
Allahu ladhi la ilaha illa huwa. It says, uh, uh, 